apps and here we have him playing for Fnatic spot in the top left corner as the pink Terran it is Soul. His opponent playing for the um Kind of notorious swarm host clan it is the blue zerg sort of i think this that's the same clan that uh, naniwo uses now like the same clan tag in game clan tag and who is this guy looks like one of those a swedish players well it's probably a swedish player sort of a swedish naniwo is swedish and oh they have this uh Big team where Runa is also in the in there and a uh, big Swedish clan gets lots of sponsors. I think they're also responsible for um, some of the tournaments. Tournaments. Yeah, too big of a friends list uh, for sure, uh, Mr. Dot Duck. I had, but I clean like before I started streaming. I uh, spent about 10-15 minutes to just clean. Clean the entire thing, uh, get rid of people that have been online in ages, uh, players that are not really competing anymore, stuff like that. Alright, uh, so we have a uh, barracks into gas from Seoul. And nothing coming out of sort of yet. Probably gonna go, yep. At first, as expected, the Overlord is already on its way, and he's getting the second one out there as well. So he'll have a nice little spot, have one of the overlords uh, sitting over here. Just so you can uh, try to enter into the main base via this route and uh, see when the expansion has been taken. And then send the second overlord in from the right and scout out what's going on in this part of the base. Foxtrot Labs is not one of those really huge maps. So... Um, it's still one of those maps that, uh, where you can't really go for a three hatch before pool. So I'm not surprised that sort of is going though, um, going the route with the hatch first into pool. First Reaper is in production, and Soul still in gas for everything. Maybe he's gonna throw a couple of Reapers in the mix, and see how sort of deals with the pressure. Yep, there's the second Reaper. Four links being produced immediately, of course also throwing out the queen. Second queen should come into production here pretty soon. Yep, that's the second queen. Four links and queen. Let's see how he handles the pressure. Just a single reaper for now, but the second one will come into the fray pretty soon here as well. And behind this, uh, Sol is going for a command center. There we go. Reaper is at the natural. Still waiting. Kind of interesting. Really know what he's doing here. Maybe just to fake out that there um, this is not another Reaper coming, and this one is just used for for scouting. But still, two Reapers don't really do all that much. Four links are up here, and they're waiting. Oh yeah, waiting on that little the little tight spot. Reaper might get a couple shots. Ooh, sort of. He's not careful losing a single drone. Not really necessary here, but the Reaper also took some damage. Second Reaper will come in and might actually get a couple shots off as well. Um, well, he's trying to find an angle, but it's not going to work on Creep. So we'll have to go the route down there. And with only four links, yeah. Was a little bit undecisive. Undecisive. He could have could have gotten another kill here, but now with uh, speed almost finishing up, sort of can defend any of these shenanigans. No, wor no worries whatsoever. Um, as I said, command center is in production here, so uh, that's his third CC already. And now, so we'll try to um, establish a little bit of map presence with these aliens and try to stop the creep spread. Well, we have two queens uh, just on front here for sort of, and he's going for the Roach Warren. Could need another queen here just to um, defend against these Hellions a little bit easier, but since he is getting the Roach Warren, he just needs to buy a little bit of time. And with only a couple of Hellions coming in, um, he should be in a good spot. But they will get rid of one of these creep tumors. Yep, that's the first one going down. 
And a lot of Reapers, I think, sort of. Uh, he might need a couple more units here. The Roach Warren is almost finished, so he doesn't really want to invest any larvae into Lynx right now. And Soul is just content with um, with stopping the creep spread. He knows, okay, if I if I can stop the creep spread right now, I'm in a good spot. I can probably take down this third. And the Overseer gets in there, sees everything, sees the third CC, so he knows, okay, this is not some crazy amount of pressure that's coming in. Just a little bit of map presence, just a little bit of... Um, of showing, okay, I'm here, you need to produce a couple units. Need to spend a little bit of minerals on your army. army. And there's the plus one, plus one armor coming in. Or sort of. And Reapers, still getting into the mix. And no Roaches will spawn yet. So these Reapers, they can just roam freely here. You can save one of these drones. Second one. Oh, some good reaction time coming out of sort of. And that's the Reapers going down. Of course, these drones were also saved. And, wow, this looks kind of freaky. Sort of sees these aliens. <laughs> that was pretty crazy right there. He could have had a lot more drones if he would have just reacted <laughs> a little bit faster here. But sort of also um, getting right on top of things and uh, dealing with this. Plus one armor and plus one missile attacks are on the way now. While um, Sol is working on a starport, getting a reactor and the um, stim upgrade is also almost done as well. So he'll get a nice little timing. I don't think these Hellions will actually get in there. He might lose one more if he's not careful. Yep, no, they're kind of trapped up here. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's the next Hellions going out. Ooh, some good control by Sword of, but not quite getting all the Hellions. Well, these Lynx might. Yes, they will. And that's the last one going down. Good job. Sort of cleaning everything up. But Sol uh, did use this little divergent tactic uh, to get his third base established. Still, he lost uh, double, the, double the amount of minerals. But these were only small skirmishes so far. So it doesn't really matter all that much. There was the scan in the natural. Okay. Sees the uh, Roach Warren is still working, Evil Chamber is still working. But this is a nice little timing here for Sword of. He's getting a lot of Roaches established. Uh, speed for the Roaches is done. Plus more missile attacks almost done, and that's 15 more Roaches for you. But he doesn't have a Bailing Nest, and that's a lot of Marines. And Marines do really well versus Roaches, but these are plus one Roaches, and it's a lot of them. Can he focus down the bunker? Uh, yes, it looks like he can. That's a lot of SCVs. They can, wow, they can heal this up so quickly. The roaches will have to try to get away. And the simp for you. Still doing a lot of damage. Roaches are closing in. Second bunker did get finished, but he's standing right on top of it. Still focus firing down the marines that are not in bunkers yet, but he will get rid of that second bunker. And more and more roaches are streaming in. Maybe he should micro those, uh, those little bit of damage roaches back. But he's just content with taking out this command center, so should react here. Yes, and he will. Maybe a drop attempt by Soul. I don't think he can really spare any units right now. That's Widow Mines react to the pressure here. Not switched over to Siege Tank production just yet. And sort of also transitioning out of this pure Roach composition, going for the Hydralist then. Getting more and more uh, workers now. It was th this was still a pretty strong attack early on, so he sacrificed a little bit of economy. But since he did get rid of uh, Soul's third base, I, I think he's still in a good spot. Still continuing to do pressure. That's the bunker falling for you. But a nice little choke point established for Soul here. Still, these roaches are standing right on top of him. And he doesn't, ha doesn't have too many units left. SCVs have to be pulled here. And that's way too many roaches for him to deal with right now. He doesn't have any siege tanks to stop this onslaught. But still, SCVs are helping out quite a bit, but sort of is content with just killing all of these SCVs. He does have a follow-up, and he's producing more and more roaches behind this. I do think uh, he's gonna switch into Hydras here pretty soon, since he did get such a good start. But uh, plus two weapons is also in the works here for Soul. He will lose that command center though pretty soon. Almost certain of it. Yep, he can't really do anything about it now. 
But sort of didn't actually uh, didn't actually get all of his roaches over here. He's still dealing with a little bit of a drop attempt here on on the gold base, which did lose him quite a few workers as well, down to 55. But against 22, uh, that's not too bad at all. And now the hydra's coming to play. It's also getting Groove Vines upgrade and plus two plus two, and still producing uh, a couple more drones just to get us. Get his income back up there. That's that's a lot of hydras already. A lot of hydras all spread out over the map here pretty soon. Six more on production. And did he spot the drop attempt? Not quite yet. He's still dealing with the double pronged harass here. And that's uh, Soul standing right on top of his uh, gold base once again. This tiny little drop is not really something he needs to worry about right now. But the big one over here is, there's not too many units left alive. And I think sort of is handling this quite well. So the next little drop, and he's clearing that one up as well. Now he just needs to deal uh, with these medivacs. Medivacs are kind of a nuisance for him. He's getting rid of all of the ground units, but he couldn't really snipe off the medivacs just yet. With the speed boost, they usually get away. But Soul, I mean, he's trying his best to get back in there, but he lost so many SCVs. Uh, still on two bases. He has a decent composition here with the plus two plus one. Still, Hydras are coming in from the back now. It's four medivacs, but not a lot of ground units. And that's one of the medivacs going down finally here. Ooh, <laughs> bad mana sort of <laughs> sending in the changelings. Does he have any? Um, oh, he doesn't have any reinforcements coming in, but he's he's waiting a couple of seconds for the plus two plus two. It's gonna change things quite a bit, and reinforcements are being produced right now. He's also trying to get his drone count back up there, and going for a fourth base behind this. So, sort of not relying on this single tech. Ooh, so don't make that mistake. Hydras are in position, but not quite fast enough just yet. Muscular Augments upgrade is not done. And he's also um, just... Going the easy route, going the Spore Crawler and Spine established in his main base. Just so he doesn't have to send his entire army back like he's doing right now. For a, for a single tiny drop. And I think, um, yeah, he could also just deal with this with a couple of links. Just have a mobile defense force. That could work out quite well as well. And there he is, coming into the third base again. That's a tiny little force. And if these Hydras catch him out... Nope. We have Hydras in the main, and they will finally get the kill on that on that dropship. So that's gonna stop all of these... Yeah, all of these tiny little drop antics uh, for Soul. That's a pretty huge army right there, sort of. Wow, 130 army supply with plus two, plus two. Uh, he's even getting, um, even getting Infestors behind this and going for the Hive tech. And look at that concave, beautiful, beautiful, just clearing off this third base, and that's not the best position for Soul to be in, but uh, he's making the best of it. Still, that's so many Hydras still left alive. There's a Siege Checker mix now, so it's doing massive amounts of splash damage, and sort of is just wasting these units here, but still, it's just... It's just the onslaught of Zerg. That's that's exactly how you want to play this. If you're if you're ahead in the eco game, you can just throw away these units. I would have preferred to at least save a couple of Hydras and send reinforcements in. But still, there's the GG. Sort of takes this and moves on to the round of 16.